Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha and today we're doing a very, very, very exciting video. Today what we're going to be doing is something that I really like to watch on YouTube and that is going through some persons who got called out on their lie on social media. I decided to do this because I see them and I laugh about them and I want you guys to laugh as well. Hopefully you can get a laugh from these if you've seen them already. Laugh anyway. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Let's get started. Scoot over. The first one. The first one we're going to look at is a post made by this girl. She said, I really didn't mean to post this, but SMH. Well, I can't read. I really didn't mean to post this. SMH, but whatever. Good morning. It's a nice selfie. But somebody commented and said, There's like a five step process to post a pic on IG. How oh, you didn't mean to post it? You post up, you take a picture, you go into IG, you have to choose a filter, tag people if you want to tag, tag a location, write a caption before you hit post. So if you didn't mean to post it, you wouldn't have posted it, right? So that's obviously a lie there. She, I guess she wanted a really nice caption to put and that's the best one she could come up with. It wasn't the best one, but hey, she got called out. The next one is this young man who posted a photo. Sun was in my eyes, lol. But my new friend, but my new favorite photo. If the sun was in your eyes, then why is the shadow in front of you? If the sun was in your eyes, then why is the shadow in front of you? If the sun is in your eyes, the shadow will be behind you, right? So there's no way the sun was in front of you. So why hold your eyes? Why lie to say the sun was in your eyes? I tell you, these people on social media, they will call you out. So don't even think about lying. Don't even. Next one. Hmm, interesting. This photo was posted with the caption, Gotta love morphine at the hospital. People are saying, Oh, I wish I was you. I wish I was you. Why? But that's not the point. Somebody said, You get better, man. Somebody else said, Hey, what's going on? I just spoke to your mom and she said you only got. And she said you're only getting saline drip because you had a runny poo. Um, morphine? No. Lied about morphine, got called out on your runny poo. So, a diarrhea for you. Next one is a text message between a couple. So, Lucy texted. Babe, what are you doing? Is it Lucy texted or Lucy got the text? Okay, so... <sighs> Lucy texted, Babe, what are you doing? Respond. Nothing much. I'm really tired. Just gonna go to sleep now, babe. And you? What was that voice? What? Work with it. Response. In the cub standing behind you. Lie. Next one. Oh, somebody posted this very, very nice photo. Um, and said, I took this pic. Somebody commented, but it says Nick Boyer photography. You stealing people's pictures? 
You're stealing people's pictures and saying it's yours. You didn't think nobody was gonna find out. It literally says it there. It's gonna be a bit blurry, but it's there. Nick Boyer photography. That was kind of dumb, but okay. Next. <laughs> I'm just gonna post it and let you see for yourself. Whose girlfriend? Your girlfriend? Taking a picture of you? Check your background. It's obviously you took that selfie. Check your background. Check your background. Check your background. Check your background. Okay? Okay. Next, somebody posted this gorgeous photo. A picture of my grandmother during World War II. She was so beautiful and courageous. Someone commented, that's Hayley Atwell in the Captain America movie, you idiot. I knew this, and if I could tell that this was from the Captain America movie, you should be able to know that anybody could tell. Like, guys. Captain America is such a popular movie. It was watched by so many people. How do you think you were gonna get away with it? And I'm sure that's not the only movie that she's acted in. People would have seen her elsewhere. Like, you decided to just take a random photo and lie about it? Okay. Next one is, the selfie was posted with the caption, stuck in traffic. traffic there's literally no one in front of you there's no one in front of you what traffic oh what traffic there's no one in front of you at all okay this photo was posted very nice Sane just got back from Canada I can't read. I just got back from Colorado, had an amazing trip and shredded the mountains every day. Attempted my first egg flip. That's what it's called. Picture. Don't hand, what? Didn't land it, but the pic my body took still looks amazing. Can't wait to go back. You know, people are saying, oh my god, this is so sick, this is great, nice photo. Somebody said, the photo is from a 2012 calendar and it is literally the first photo on Google image search. So full of it. First image on Google search. What? Why? The first image on Google search and you decide to take it and say it was you? Did you really think nobody was actually going to try and validate what you were saying? Wow. Wow. This was posted saying, just got home from getting my claws sharpened and saw this over my mountain. Funny story. Um. Whenever I grow my nails really long, my mother always calls them claws. So, I understand what she's saying. Hi, mom. Okay. Just got home from getting my claws sharpened and saw this over the mountain. Haven't seen this there in a long time. 92 degrees. Wow. Really? How did you see that picture by Stacy? What? How did you see that picture by Stacy Fortson over your mountain? You can see it in the. T you can see it anytime on this website, and you can even purchase this picture too. I 
I'm done. But guys, really? Why do they think that nobody's going to notice these things? People are going to notice. As you can tell, I'm changing up some of the words that I can't really see here. So this was posted on Facebook. Was this Facebook? This was posted on Facebook. Saying, dang it, my phone is dead. Obviously it says via mobile. But apparently somebody said, dang babe, we can't text. Girl, look. It says he posted it via mobile. There's no way his phone could be dead if he posted this. You know what I'm saying? Like, his phone can't be dead if he posted this. Seriously? Okay, this one, I think this is the last one I'm going to do. I never knew how poor my family was while I was growing up until I started dating a guy from the suburbs. Depressing but enlightening. Her mom responded. Her mom responded. Let's see. Food on the table, a huge yard, a bike, a swing set, birthday parties, air conditioning, heat, toys. Must have been rough. She responded. Mom, I wasn't saying we were impoverished. We had much less money than you did when you were growing up and you know that. Mom said also one more inappropriate comment and I will block you from FB. Block. So she had so many things going up, so many things that a lot of people didn't have and she decided that she was poor. Good going girl. Shame on you though. So that is the last one I'm going to do. I let me know if you watch these on YouTube. Drop a comment down below and tell me what you think of this video. Let me know if you'd like to see me do more of these types of videos or what else you'd like me to do for you guys. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Stay safe and I'll see you in my next video. Love you guys.